small but mighty antibodies offer hope for better treatments. Biotechnology is revolutionizing medicine, with antibodies crucial for disease detection and treatment. Researchers at the University of Tokyo have developed new libraries of humanized VHH, or nanobodies, a unique type of antibody fragment. Their work, published in scientific reports, introduces a novel creation method by analyzing physical and chemical properties. VHH is found at camelids, are smaller than conventional antibodies and bind to specific target molecule sites. Dr. Nakakito explained their advantage. Our work emphasizes the unique potential of VHH, particularly in their ability to recognize curved or recessed areas and move through tissues quickly because of their small size. This makes them promising for treating diseases like blood clotting disorders and autoimmune conditions. Using a large data set of VHH structures, the team improved critical parts of these fragments. They developed three VHH library types, each tailored to bind targets in specific ways. These libraries vary in the length of the complementarity determining region, CDR, which determines how the VHH attaches. Importantly, these VHH are heat stable. These libraries can generate VHH recognizing diverse targets a significant improvement over older, time-consuming methods. Professor Tsumoto explained, Our strategy not only makes the process easier, but also speeds up the creation of humanized VHH for a variety of uses. The researchers created VHH balancing durability and flexibility. These VHH can show strong potential for medical and industrial uses, such as diagnostic tests, drug delivery, and environmental monitoring. While further work is needed to improve target binding, the results are a major step forward. This work represents a significant advance in antibody design. Dr. Nakakido, Dr. Kinoshida, and Professor Tsumoto have created a guide for efficient synthetic antibody production, promising advancements in research and healthcare, and paving the way for more precise treatments.